Hello friends, welcome to Lego Life. It is a beautiful, sunny, winter Alaskan day here. Uh, kind of cold, temperature is in the teens. It was warm recently. We had several days in the 40s with rain, and so a lot of our snow went away, but we got a little bit more snow, so it feels, it feels like winter, which is nice. And stop number one for me today, stop number one is the post office, because I have not checked the PO box in a few days, and I have a feeling there's gonna be some Christmas cards in there. Let's go look. Now that the Christmas card exchange has started, let's see. Well, you guys wasted no time, did you? Uh, we have nine Christmas cards that showed up today. And I wanna show you guys this. One of the cards has a sticker on the back that has a cat with its face and a piece of bread. Uh, I can already tell I'm probably gonna love the card that's inside that one. All right, so let's see where the heck these cards are from. Now I will say we actually got our first card that came in a box from one of you, a Christmas box, a couple of days ago uh, from Colorado. Friends in Colorado were card number one because the card was technically in the Christmas box. We have a card from Tacoma, Washington, New Hampshire, Nevada, Ohio, Washington, Colorado, Texas, um, Florida, da, 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 where are you from? I don't know where this is from. Oh no, there's not a return address on this one. Oh no. And then Indiana, oh, lots of states. So the 2022 Leg Life Christmas Card Exchange in full swing. So Sherry and I will be spending part of our evening doing that. Um, earlier, I picked this up, let me show you. It is a giant box of goodies from um, Alaska Sausage and Seafood. You can see there's stuff in there, there's reindeer sausage in there, there's a whole bunch of like salmon in there, There are there's cheese, there's coffee, there's crackers, there's chocolate, just lots of stuff in there. And this is actually a thank you gift for the facilities team uh, where we had our huge fundraiser for our nonprofit a couple weeks ago. Uh, the facilities team there was amazing helping us get set up. Obviously an event for several hundred people is not an easy task. So they just, they went above and beyond and cared for us super well. And so I wanted to bring them a box of goodies just as a way to say thank you from our team at Love Alaska to the facilities team. So went and got that. I've got a couple more meetings today, and then we're gonna see Sherry Beth tonight. She is working out uh, at the Wasilla office today, so she will be home a little later, and you guys will get to see her then. So, let's keep our day going. Okay, it's a couple hours later, and I think I'm actually done with work for the day. It is, let's see what time it is. Um, it is a little after 4 p.m., and I just left the office, and I'm currently sitting in the parking lot of Costco. Uh, not because I need to get food for Sherry and I, but we actually have a good friend of ours who just had surgery today and thought it would be fun to drop off some meals to him and his wife. So I'm gonna go into Costco and see what they have for like ready-made, just heat and eat meals. It was nice that it got warm for a few days because it like melted all of the ice and snow <laughs> in the parking lots. So at least we're not having to push shopping carts through snow and ice. All right, so purchase one has been made. My friend who had surgery is a big Scotch fan, so I picked up a nice Macallan 12 years. So gift number one, done now. Let's find some food. And they have a couple kids, so gotta get a box of applesauce pouches. I got this charcuterie sampler and some cheese. Figure meats and cheeses are always helpful to have just in the fridge to snack on. All right, this is what we're looking for. Their chicken street tacos are so good. So I'm gonna grab one of those. And then they also have these chicken quesadillas. I have not seen those before. And yakisoba stir fry. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. And over here we've got enchiladas, mac and cheese, chicken alfredo. What do we got down here? Oh man, a ravioli lasagna with beef sauce. Let's get one of those for sure. Okay, so I think we're going with street tacos, lasagna, chicken alfredo, charcuterie, and applesauce, and of course, scotch. All right, so here's everything I got. I think you guys saw all of it, with the exception of this. They did have a gelato four pack. And come on, when you have surgery, you need some like ice cream, gelato, something fun to eat, right? So I think we got like three meals, some snacks, some treats. 
I think that's uh, kind of exactly what I was hoping for. Okay, so the next stop is actually to take the food to our friends, and they live up, well, on the side of the mountain. You guys know that to the uh, to the east of Anchorage is the Chugach Mountains, and they live up there. So, I'm not in the Jeep with four-wheel drive. I am in Sherry's car uh, with studded tires. So, it may be a little bit of an adventure, but we're gonna go up there and try to, get the, <laughs> try to get the food to them. And then, by the time we get back down the hill, I think and hope Sherry will be home. She is actually, I totally forgot this, she's getting her hair done today. Sherry's getting her hair freshly dyed, so when you guys see her, she will have, well, I think pinks and purples and stuff. I think she's doing the same thing. I honestly, I never know with Sherry. Like, whenever she's like, I'm gonna get my hair done, I just don't necessarily know what to expect. So whatever Sherry Beth wanted is what Sherry will get. So when we see her, we'll see what her hair looks like. So the first thing I decided to do before I head up the mountain is fill up the car with gas. And I thought I'd show you guys what gas is here in Anchorage, Alaska. Uh, 444 for regular. I just got the best text as I was filling up the car with gas. Sherry texted and said she got back into town earlier than she expected. And she was actually only like blocks away from me. And so we decided to meet in a parking lot and uh, we will take the Jeep up to our friend's house. So Sherry will go with me. That's fun. I had planned on just dropping everything off and then um, going home and waiting for Sherry. But now you get to see her soon. You guys, look who's there. Sherry. Hi, Sherry. Hi. How's your hair? I told him you got it done today. Good. Nice and colorful. Um, now, before I show you what I got our friends for dinners and stuff, I want you to know I own, I stuck to the necessities. Okay. okay? Again, I stuck to the necessities. Okay. I got street tacos <laughs> and lasagna and gelato and applesauce. Okay. And I got a <laughs> bottle of scotch. Of course. He likes scotch. That's true. That's true. Only the necessities. <laughs> so we just left our friend's house. It is a long drive up here, but you guys look at the view. Anchorage all spread out before us. You can see the sunset over there, the inlet down there. Pretty darn beautiful. So we just got back home and this is fun. Again, this is, <laughs> I love Alaska because we uh, took the food to our friends and he was like, do you want some wild beef? <laughs> what? They just got uh, like a third of a cow, a local cow from an island here in Alaska. Yes, you do. That has local beef. And so we got just like a big old hunk of beef. And the beef is not the coolest thing we got. Their daughter drew us a picture. All right, we gotta show this. This is so cute. Look at Missy, you guys. Look how cute. That is pretty, that's a pretty spot on Missy. It's pretty good. All right, let's go find Missy and compare. Missy girl, hi sweetie. Um, We have a, we need to do a comparison real quick. Maddie drew you a picture. That's you. Look at Look that. how pretty you are. That is that is a spot on Missy. <laughs> I love it. So that's definitely going on our fridge. <laughs> Sherry Beth, I have a question. They've seen a lot of me in today's vlog. Yeah. They've not seen a ton of you. Yeah. How's your day been? Okay. Yeah? Still fighting a cold. Yeah. It's so. not, mine hung on for over a week. I feel like it was like seven, eight, nine days. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm right about the week mark. So it's... Hopefully it goes away soon. Hopefully it goes away soon, but getting up early and driving is not my favorite thing. Yeah, we should be anyway, sl sleeping. Though, especially when I'm not feeling super awesome, so. Totally, so you're working out there tomorrow, mm -hmm. home on Friday, yep. home on Monday, yep. out there on Tuesday. Yeah, this short week, next week. But Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. and I don't know that we've told them what we're doing for Thanksgiving. We're going to Juneau. We are flying to Juneau, Alaska for Thanksgiving. Hang out with the Brooks fam. And our friend Amanda. Yep. Coming down there, so yep. very excited. Yes. Uh, about a Thanksgiving with friends in Juneau, Alaska. Friendsgiving. A friendsgiving in <laughs> Juneau. Yep. We are starting to tackle Christmas cards now. Um, here's the stack of cards we got today. We have actually gone through and trying to get like ahead of the game. We have been pre-stamping our cards so that it just kind of saves time when these come in. Our plan is every single night that we get a stack of cards from our P.O. Box to get them done and get them mailed out so that we don't ever get behind. So, that's what we're gonna do now. And I know, I know I talked about this earlier, but I just can't get over this sticker. So far, it's the highlight of the Christmas card exchange to me. It's so funny. Sherry Beth, I want you to do that <laughs> sticker, isn't it? 
right? <laughs> okay, that's really funny. <laughs> like, that's winning. I wish I could like... Save that? Save it. Me too. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, stack of Christmas cards, ready to be mailed tomorrow. Hello friends, it is the next morning. Last night, Sherry and I just kind of hung out around the house, forgot to pick the camera back up again. Uh, she is off to work today. I just finished up some like computer work here at home and I am heading off to my first meeting of the day. I uh, wanna give you a little peek as to what it looks like outside. It is a beautiful day outside. You can see mostly sunny, few clouds, but even the clouds are pretty. I have Sherry's car today. Uh, she has the Jeep working out in Wasilla, so I am just kind of running around. Stop number one, I need to drop these bad boys off uh, at the post office. And then we have a couple things later today that we're doing. Um, after work, we are going to a local brewery for a fundraiser. Some of you will remember that last year I did Grow Nation through the American Cancer Society. We raised a whole bunch of money to fight cancer and to support, and to support uh, patients with cancer and their families. And you know what? Doing it again. It is a beard growth challenge during the month of November. Do you guys remember when I did like the Alaska State Flag glitter beard? Uh, so won my category last year. Doing it again this year. What an awesome cause to raise money for. Um, it, and I think I said this last year, cancer is one of those things that I just feel like we all have a story of how it's impacted us. It's impacted someone that we love, a family that we love. And so it's one of the things that I wanna to do to help raise money for. Uh, Sherry and I thought it wouldn't be fair to ask you guys to help us raise money until we did that first. So we gave the first $500 to my campaign. We would love to double that. Let's reach $1,000 to help support families. Uh, my giving link is down below the donation link for this campaign and more on that later. We'll bring you guys along to the brewery, show you all that fun stuff. And then after that, we are going to pub quiz. Trivia at a local place called Willowa. Um, some of the employees who work for me, actually most of the team wants to do this. They've been, I'm getting a text. They've been asking if we can go do this as a team and I love pub quiz. Sherry loves trivia. And so we thought, you know what? Tonight's the perfect night. So we have a work team, gosh darn it, and we are going to compete. I think it's gonna be a ton of fun. We'll see if I bring you guys along. It's still super awkward. Even though they all know that we have a YouTube channel, it's still awkward like vlogging around them. So ugh, we'll see if I can get up the nerve, but Step number one, let's mail these. There we go, they are off. And I suppose while we're here, we could check and see if we got more since yesterday. And we did. I think we've officially reached the season where I need to remember to come to the post office like at least every other day so they don't build up too much. We did, I do wanna say, um, when we sat down last night and wrote out all of the Christmas cards and read the letters and read a lot of the things you guys wrote, um, it made me, so you guys know we've been missing a lot of uploads lately. Haven't been uploading as much. Um, YouTube has felt more of a burden in the last season, but reading your notes last night, I started to feel that excitement to make videos again because of all the kind things you guys were saying and sharing. And like, I don't know, as we were reading those, I just started to get so excited about YouTube because YouTube means we get to connect with you guys. So thank you for everyone who's already sent a Christmas card and told us about yourself and like shared part of your story. It is, um, it's more of an encouragement to, to Sherry and I than you could possibly know. So thank you so much for taking the time to do that. We love you guys so very much. Um, I haven't had coffee yet today. It's, what time is it even? It's 11.10 and I haven't had coffee. Let's go through a drive through coffee place, get a coffee, and then I actually have an 11.30 meeting. So I have 20 minutes to get a coffee and get to my meeting. I can do this, let's go. I'm in line at Aftershock Espresso and I love that they put a Santa hat on top of the like glittery skeleton face that is on the base of what I think this summer was a sunflower. So a very multi-use thing going on right there. Also, like there's just a guy standing in the drive-thru ahead of me. I think we all need coffee today, especially that glittery guy. A cold brew with cream is exactly what I wanted. I actually thought today may be a day that I get a hot coffee because it is kind of chilly outside. And then I got up to the window and I was like, do you guys have cold brew? She said, yes. And I thought, dang it. Now I have to get a cold coffee. So again, cold brew with cream. Perfect. Now on to my next meeting. I will say I'm not complaining about meeting location number one because a meeting here at Beartooth Theater Pub 
Lunch meetings, always my favorite. Well, it is several hours later. Obviously, I'm home, Sherry's home. Uh, I just, I, I had plans of vlogging more of my day. <laughs> and then, it, it was one of those days where I had a number of meetings back to back, but I had given myself a little bit of time between each meeting to get to the meeting. The problem is that like, if the first meeting runs long, it dominoes every other meeting. And that's exactly what happened today. <laughs> and so once the first meeting went long, I was just like the whole rest of my day is messed up. <laughs> and it was. Love. It's fine. We're home now. We're changed. Sherry Beth, how was your day? It was okay. Okay. It was unproductive. <laughs> Um, you you went tanning today? We went tanning and then we decided, me and my boss, and then we decided that we didn't feel like going back to the office, her <laughs> choice, and so then we went and got lunch. And then when we got back to the office, we hung up some like framed pictures in my office. We just, we, neither one of us were really like focused today. Just one of those days. <laughs> told you to get that. We did, although there was a little bit of excitement today. We did have an earthquake. Like a 5.0? A 5.0 in uh, Point McKenzie, which is real close to Wasilla, so where which I where, was. Yeah. Um, and pretty shallow, and it was it was quite the shaker. It was quite the shaker. We instantly texted. Not okay. <laughs> it was really funny because like it happened, and I was in a meeting in Anchorage, and Sherry was at work in Wasilla, and it happened, and I instantly picked up my phone <laughs> to go to text Sherry, and I already saw the three little dots from <laughs> Sherry, and I was like, oh, she beat me to it. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, it was a shaker. It was a shaker. But now we're gonna go to. I think I told you guys earlier. Uh, we have a little bit of a fundraiser for the Grow Nation Sherry. What do you think I should do? I, last year I did the State of Alaska Glitter Beard. Mm -hmm. I don't know what to do this year for the beard competition. I don't know. I don't know. So I need you guys to let me know in the comments below. What should I do? I'm in the freestyle category. So you can do whatever you want. I can do whatever you want. One of my ideas is like a Christmas beard. So buying some of those beard ornaments mm -hmm. and doing like a Christmas tree decorated beard. I have beard? something that's not allowed. What? You're not allowed to like shave weird things. <laughs> like don't suggest that because he's not gonna do that. Just so we're clear. <laughs> you guys can suggest that, it's fine. You it can won't, suggest it, it won't happen. We're not gonna, we're not gonna do that. Ah, oh, that's fine, that. that's fine. <laughs> but it is, what time? 5.34, yep. what time were we gonna leave the house? 5.30. Okay, so we're gonna go, come on, let's go. Hey Sherry, Yeah. you're pretty. <laughs> I just told Sherry that I've realized I don't know where this brewery is we're going to. It's a place called Brew Works. Uh, it is one of the newer breweries in town and I have no clue. Probably find that out. Try find it out. However, Sherry Beth, mm -hmm. do you know who is gonna be at this brewery tonight? Yeti dogs. Oh, okay. So I think we're I'm going excited. to we're going to get to drink some beer. We're going to support the American Cancer Society and eat some Yeti dogs. Eat some Yeti dogs. Okay. I'm not mad about that. Nope. Let's go. All right. Well, it took us way too long to find this place. Um, <laughs> Maps down there. We like... So we thought it was like somewhere down there. And so we drove around the building, drove around the building, drove around the building. And then Sherry was like, what if it's farther down this road? Spoiler alert. It is. It is farther down this road. <laughs> All right. Let's get Yeti dogs. Let's go check out Brew Works. Okay. Look how amazing that is. Reindeer dog on a pretzel bun, cream cheese, relish, ketchup, mustard, grilled onions. And we get to go inside and have beers and support the Cancer Society. Perfect. Okay, so this place is absolutely amazing. They do all the brewing here, brewing here. They have like a huge upstairs area over there. Really nice downstairs area. Back over here, which is where our Grow Nation table is. This place is so nice. Okay, we were there for about half an hour. Yep. Um, got to see a bunch of friends. Yep. But Sherry Beth, let's talk about that brewery space. It was really cool. I'm genuinely surprised I haven't been there. That is one of the nicest brewery spaces in Anchorage. I would agree. And that might be, we got to meet the owner. Mm -hmm. I think he is the nicest brewery owner I've ever met. He was very nice, yep. Just very personable. I got water and he was like, how is your water? I make the best water in town. <laughs> he was so funny and so nice. I like, so <laughs> I gotta say, Brew Works, uh, we will be back 
especially when they have Yeti Dog. Yep. And this is what's so cool. Uh, you guys know that we love Yeti Dog. We've talked about it in a lot of videos. Yeah. Anchorage has a ton of hot dog stands. They're all super good. Yeti is the best. Yeah. Like the best. And <laughs> mostly because they know us and she now carries like cream, cream cheese, cheese for us and just knows like yeah. one or two. <laughs> we're yeah, we're very biased when it comes <laughs> to them for sure. Right. Um but I didn't know they were doing this tonight. This is really cool. She's donating all proceeds to the American Cancer Society. Yeah, she said all sales go to um ACS. So yep. That's super cool. So again, the whole reason doing Gronation is Last year, we talked about this in a video, I think I talked about it in the video before, when we were thinking about causes to support, um, to kind of let you, the Lug Life community, know about, mm -hmm. cancer was one of those, it's one of the few things that I feel like all of us have some story attachment to. Yes, everybody knows somebody who has had cancer or has had cancer themselves, and so it's just one of those things that I think touches everybody. Yeah, and so that's why, that's why it's something that we, that we want to support and use here on Leg Life. Obviously, we don't we don't talk about lots of causes. We don't talk about lots of things. We don't ask you guys to donate to lots of things, yeah. but this is one that we think is important. And so, yeah. uh, again, we donated the first $500. We think it'd be awesome if we could raise $1,000. So, link down below if you want to support my Grow Nation. And again, if you have ideas for my beard, <laughs> that don't did apparently shaving weird shapes into your beard i'm not shaving weird shapes okay. what if i shaved into a mustache <laughs> absolutely not no shade to the guys watching who might have mustaches <laughs> but sherry just not a fan <laughs> not, not a, a fan, fan. <laughs> all right so from one event we're going to the next now yeah. we're going downtown to willowa for trivia night yeah. Pub quiz. Geeks who drink is what it's called. <laughs> um, and hey, that's me. <laughs> you are a geek who, although you're not drinking because you're still on Dayquil. I know I'm not drinking tonight because of the Dayquils, which is why I got water. So we're going downtown. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog you guys. It's so awkward around people that well, I work it was with. Really loud and yeah, I don't know. <sighs> so we'll maybe, maybe I'll give you a wrap up at the end of the night. Yeah. So let's get downtown. All right, we just parked here in downtown Anchorage, and we are going over here across the street to. Willowa, uh, Sherry Beth, we have not been here, I feel like in a while. It's been a while. Yeah. It has been a while. Um, they do a lot of concerts here, like a live music venue. Obviously they do things like this. Um, they have a restaurant. They used to have, some of you may remember, a speakeasy upstairs. I feel like that's what we came here for the most. Yes. Was like the speakeasy. Yes. I don't know if the speakeasy is still a thing. Here we go, let's head in and Play some pub quiz. Well, we did not win pub quiz. The whole place is cleared out, but look at this. They have a band over here at this side of Willowa tonight with an upright bass. This looks awesome. However, I think Sherry Beth is tired, so we are gonna head home. We just left Willowa across the street. There's Flat Top, which is like a pizza place, little bar. And then this area right here used to be a cocktail lounge called Sub Zero. That's amazing. We, I had my 30th birthday party. I threw a 30th <laughs> birthday party that was pink themed. I had them yes. make a special drink. Yes. And we are so sad. It was like the coolest bar in town. Like I loved it. And now. Now storage, apparently. <laughs> it's just storage. That's so sad. Oh man, that, that is like such a bummer. Dang it, we loved Sub-Zero. Also, your 30th birthday was amazing. It was also 11 years ago. That's okay, sad. well, we don't need to talk about that. <laughs> How was Pub Quiz tonight? It was a lot of fun. Yeah? <laughs> we didn't do super awesome, but we didn't do terrible. There we were, were, I think... Mediocre. There were like 14, 13 or 14 teams, we finished seventh. Mm -hmm. Right? And we like hung out at seventh, like the entire time. <laughs> we were middle of the road the whole way. Uh, it, I will say, Pub Quiz is one of those things that if you go with a fun group, it doesn't matter how you do. Right. And tonight we had a fun group. We had a fun group. It was just fun. So much laughter. Yep. Uh, I've got to say, <laughs> Sherry, I do think maybe the MVP of the team. <laughs> there were some answers that you pulled out that I was, and all of us were just like, what? The one that shocked me was the Nirvana song that you didn't know and I did. I am. I don't know Nirvana song. I literally know one, and it was the one song that, that we needed. I was shocked, and so Sherry Beth. I was like, just put this because I think that's what it is. It was on the audio it round, was. and Sherry Beth crushed it. <laughs> it was so much fun, though. It was fun. 
I think we're actually gonna go back in two weeks. Uh, we kind of made plans like so uh, two weeks from now. So <laughs> I think this may become, it's really fun because a lot of bars around Anchorage do this in the winter. And one of the keys to living in Alaska in the winter is you've got to force yourself to get out and do things. Yeah. If you stay inside, you will go crazy. Yeah, but a lot of places will do like indoor activities. And so it's not yep. just like going and hang out at a bar, like it's going for pub quiz and whatever. So it's, yep. it's fun. Yeah. So th this may be one of our new winter activities. <laughs> um, and I have a feeling that we're going to end up growing. So technically we had too many people for our team tonight. Yeah, technically uh, we couldn't win even if we did win because we had seven instead of six. The max was six. And I have a feeling that, <laughs> so I have a couple people on my team that couldn't be here tonight who wanted to be. Right. And so I have a feeling that we're going to get like such a big group that we're going to end up having like two teams each week. It'll be fun though. Yeah. Anyway, I think that's where we're going to end the vlog. Um, I was telling them earlier, and I haven't told you this. Uh-oh. <laughs> no, no, this is not a bad thing. Oh, no. <laughs> How I've been struggling with vlogging lately. We've missed days. I've just, I just feel like I've lost some of the excitement and the desire. But when we sat down and read the Christmas cards from everybody and just the stories <laughs> they shared about what this channel has meant to them and like things that even some of you guys shared things that our channel has gotten you through yeah it kind of gave me that like i'm feeling that desire to start vlogging again yeah and i just like so when i think of like okay what's my high from the last couple of days it was that moment sitting down in our living room reading your guys cards and like reading the letters so i would be like stamping or i'd be like putting labels on stuff and sherry would be reading the cards out loud mm -hmm. and that like highlight yeah that was a lot of fun so yep all right guys love you so much again link down below to my grow nation if you want to support the beard fundraiser for the american cancer society um again our christmas card exchange is still going on mm -hmm. <sighs> next week is thanksgiving yes it is so we're going to juno excited for all of that stuff we love you guys so much and we'll see you on the next lug life video